Well, hello, fellow romance researchers. Welcome to the Love Scientist, where we don't believe that love is magic, but it is science. And we help you with the chemistry of connection and the data of dating so you can be more successful in romance. And let's just face it, no matter how good or bad your relationship is, sometimes it feels a little rough around the edges. But hey, there's some good news here because you might just be in a very healthy relationship. Let's put it to the test scientifically. Today, we're diving into 10 science backed by real research that shows your relationship might just be thriving. So get your lab and notebooks out. We're going to get right to it. All right, sign number nine, you keep your identity. According to Lewandowski at all of 2011, self-expansion and relationship satisfaction, as well as a 2011 study in the Journal of Personality and Social Psychology found that couples who maintain their sense of self, meaning their own hobbies, goals, and friendships, report higher satisfaction and less resentment. Because over time, as, as you two are being restricted from the things that you enjoy because the other person doesn't want you to do it or thinks it's taken away from the we mentality, whatever the case may be, it's going to cause you to, to have a lot of resentment towards that person. Um, and that's obviously not healthy. So when you can keep your identity, and that's, that's to some degree celebrated in this relationship, it's very, very healthy. All right, and finally, number 10, you fight the right way. According to Gottman J1994, why marriages succeed or fail, disagreements are normal, but how you fight, that's the key. According to Dr. John Gottman's 40-year research at the University of Washington, found that couples who use soft startups, avoid criticism, and use humor during conflict are far more likely to stay together. He calls it the magic ratio, five positive interactions for every one negative one. If every single disagreement turns into a fight and goes from disagreement to fight and just accelerates, getting hotter and hotter, you're not fighting the right way. Uh, being able to fight the right way to always make you leave that argument feeling like you were able to come back together is only going to be a big win. So how many of these signs did your relationship check off? Let us know in the comments below. And remember, healthy relationships aren't perfect. They're just built on growth, trust, and a whole lot of science. So don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And we put all of our scientific sources below. 